Hello everybody, my name is Stephen Mottestad and welcome to tut.sm. Now I've got a nice little tutorial for today. It is on how to make a bootable free NAS USB stick for your NAS or server. So, what do we need to do? Well, we need to download free NAS first. So let's go to click on download. And this will take you to the newsletter. If you want it, then you can subscribe. If you don't, then you can just hit no thank you. So I don't want it. Then you want to just go all the way down to alternate download and you want to download the current stable version of FreeNAS for the USB image. Then you want to just hit download. Now you need two other pieces of software. I'm just going to cancel this download because I already downloaded it. So the other two pieces of software, what you want is you want 7zip.org and it is a basically an extractor so you can extract files that are like WinRAR or 7-zip or anything like that. And the other one is the Win32 Disk Imager. And you can find about these two sites, I will put them into the description for you. So when you've downloaded those and installed them, then you can continue with the rest of this tutorial. So first off you want to go down to downloads. And then you want to just right click it and then you want to go to 7-zip and extract to this folder. And that will just take a few seconds, about 16 depending on your computer. Might be less, might be more. So when it's finished extracting, what we want to do is go to start and then just type in win32. Oh, it's actually found it for me. So you just want to hit yes when it tells you that you want to open this program, etc, etc. So when this is open, you want to navigate to this folder. So we want to hit on the folder and then go to download and you want to go to the image folder and then just click on the image and hit open and bring that back to the forefront. And then what we want to do is we want to check to make sure this is your USB drive. What I forgot to tell you about. So please insert your USB drive into the computer that you want to use for your free NAS. So when you've done that, you want to just check this. And if I'm right, mine is D drive and it's got on titles. So I'm happy with that. And then you want to just hit right. It'll ask if you want to continue with this one as the target you want to hit yes and then it will start doing its business so that is it for this tutorial i hope you found it useful please subscribe rate and comment and hope to see you soon again bye